A lot of us don't know there are millions of recalled products surrounding us. And in a surprising test tonight, ABC's David Curley walks into an average house looking for recalled products and finds we're not as aware as we think. Five-year-old Sophia Justice is not happy because these firefighters are trying to remove a recalled Easy Bake oven that is stuck on her hand. I was so scared. A million of the toys, which can trap a child's hand and possibly burn them, were recalled. Sophia's mom bought the toy at a garage sale. I found out it was a recall toy. It's hard to keep track. A child safety group says only 10% of recalled products are ever returned, replaced, or repaired, often becoming hand-me-downs, garage sale items. The government says millions of homes could have a danger lurking. Do you? Hi there. We went to visit Roxanne Stuver and her three young children with Patty Davis. Well, I want to check this one. Davis is with the Consumer Product Safety Commission. So this Fingers. actual stroller had yes. has been recalled? Recalled for a finger amputation Fingers. danger from the hinge. The CPSC works with companies which voluntarily recall products with problems. What is the serial number? Yeah. 011235. This stroller is also recalled. Two for three. Great. <laughs> this recall for a string that could cause a choking danger. But with a snip, the danger is gone. Yay! But up in the baby's room, a mattress recalled. Crib mattresses are not properly sized and they create a gap. They do. And a light in the baby's room also recalled. In all, we found four items that needed to be fixed or removed. What do you make of all that? It sounds like I shouldn't be buying or getting hand-me-downs. That's one way. Or do what our expert did. Go to cpsc.gov and type in the name of the product. Sign up for email alerts and fill out those warranty cards to keep something like this from happening in your home. David Curley, ABC News, Washington. So glad she's fine. Thank you, David. And if you want to look at a list of the most recently recalled products, go to abcnews.com.